and gentlemen, we present the future home of Atlantis. Well, I think Atlantis belongs here. I mean, I think that, uh, you know, after the last flight and the last orbiter, I think what a, I couldn't think of a more fitting place to display it for, like I said, generations to come. Captain Ferguson, thank you for taking our baby up and bringing her back home safely. Truly appreciate that. I was here for the launch of Atlantis, and I held with bated breath for her safe return. But what's pleasing to my heart this morning is to see our young children here, to experience this because you would not see another shuttle take off, but you will see new vehicles going into low Earth orbit and maybe into deep space one day. Orbital Vehicle 104, or OV-104, or more commonly known as Atlantis, was the fourth orbiter to join NASA's fleet. Bringing Atlantis to the visitor center is actually bringing her home. Atlantis will be an exhibit if she's on orbit, payload bay doors open, doing what all the shuttles did remarkably for those 30 years. Not only will our guests be able to see close to one of three space-flown orbiters, they will engage in lots of interactive activities with simulators that can be used to grab satellites, to crawl through a model of the International Space Station. I would like to personally thank NASA for their confidence in Delaware North and for letting us be part of this incredible journey. It's been unbelievable. It is an honor to create the home for Space Shuttle Atlantis and to work with NASA to tell its story to the world.